Hello folks. You know, when a viewer of one of my last videos suggested that I drop a small airplane from my quadcopter, I thought about it again. You see, I also thought about that years before too. You know, at that time, I had the same concerns that I have this time, because I always try to figure out what could go wrong and then try to go from there. You see, when I was flying my flying airport platform, we found that the suction on top of the platform screen made it harder to take off, but the air was smooth. Underneath the quad, though, the turbulence is really tremendous, especially down in ground effect, so I figured that would never work for dropping planes. So, still thinking, I thought, well, I don't know for sure unless I try, so, you know, I decided to mount the servo release on my Blade 350 using a separate transmitter receiver and powered by five button cells uh, because the Blade 350 doesn't have a fifth channel output. At least mine doesn't. Even though I've got the plane balanced and it hangs perfectly horizontal, I do expect the wind to beat it up. So let's find out. Here's how it went with a few more lessons learned. 